two points right before the half, maybe get some points before the half with a minute to go in the half. But Peyton Manning cannot complete to Demarius Thomas. 22 to nothing was your score when Bruno Mars took the stage. But third quarter, Bruno Seattle, remember, job, remember Seattle deferred. Yep. Now they get the ball, and Percy Harvin is down, yeah. out the gate. We and don't Guess what, Prime? What? It was just 12 seconds into this half that they scored two. <laughs> we, see this, we see this catching the ball off the bounce. And normally when a ball bounces, it migrates all the defensive players together, and that's all Percy Harvin needed. 87 yeah. yards, the 12th man watching them score 12 seconds into each half of Super Bowl 48. Peyton Manning down 29 nothing. Trying to go for all Demarius Thomas offensive broken pass up. Offensive interference as well. And that was just perfect position by that Richard. That was offensive pass interference. They should have called it. Yeah, we talked about that matchup and who would win. And well, Sherman played very well today. So Peyton now 29 to nothing. Six minutes to go in the third quarter. There's a nice catch by Demarius Thomas. Except he doesn't hold on to the ball. And who's on the spot? But Malcolm Smith. Hey, it, you know you, you want to call that sloppy play. But when you look at the ridge. replay, such a great play by Mac. Heads up play by Maxwell right there. That's what you need to do. Every time the Broncos yep. seem like they got it going, the ball bounced the other way. Those turnover Thursday is what they practice. Turnover Thursday. And the play fake to Marshawn Lynch after the turnover. What a throw. Russell Wilson to lock it. 19-yard gain. Next play on the Broncos, 23. Wilson to go find himself some curse on first and 10. 23 yards. And uh, no, no, this, kid, this kid is one of those no. kids undrafted that that you, you heard Richard Sherman talk about nobody wanted him Pete Carroll takes him in and look what ha what happens and it, it doesn't matter who Russell Wilson is throwing the football to they all put their bodies on the line on the and line. they make those catches and the run after the catch is always special yeah, for them and it's 36 to nothing you know what's a factor of 36 12 yeah. <laughs> there's 12 everywhere 36 nothing yeah, right. when finally the Broncos get on the board with no time left in the third quarter to make it 36 to 7. So we would not have a shutout in Super Bowl 48. It's 36 to 8 as Demarius Thomas sets the records for most receptions in a Super Bowl. But Doug Baldwin, your X Factor from the NFC Championship I game, love Marshall. This. I love this kid, man. Made it a 40 burger in Super And then the first snap of the game goes into the end zone. It looked like Peyton Manning was audibling, but the center snaps the football. No Sean Marino hops on it 12 seconds into the game. And it's hit it to 12 men already had an effect. The 12 right? men, 12 right. seconds into the game leads to two points right off the bat. The quickest score in the history good, of right? the Super Bowl as Manny Ramirez snapped it before Manning was ready. Next Seahawks possession with some quality field position. Here's Percy Harvin around the edge. Oh. We were wondering what factor he would be. 30 quick yards right there in he the first a quarter. Difference, Rich. He made a huge difference. He stretched that defense wide and let Marshawn Lynch hit him in the middle. But the Broncos defense held him to just three. It's 5 nothing later in the first quarter when that's Doug Baldwin 37 yards. But again, the Broncos defense bent, did not break. It's just 8 nothing. So Peyton Manning has a chance to march down the field and just make it a one-point game, except on third and seven, he throws it high to Cam Chancellor. Bad throw, bad read, great play by Cam Chancellor. He Pressured by started, Cliff Averill. And I thought I started sensing intimidation right around here this You're early. right, Mike. This early. I mean, you got a nice lane. You stepped up in the pocket. Misread that is a horrible and, throw. And, and and the effort by Julius, I mean, maybe he was in a bad position, or maybe there was some pain coming. And that turnover would be turned into points thanks to a pass interference call in the end zone. Seattle fans have remember Super Bowls where the pass interference in the end zone was called on their receiver, not the defender. That put the ball on the one yard line this time. And then Marshawn Lynch, there's that action boss right up the middle for the <laughs> touchdown. 15 nothing Seattle. So it's time for Denver to do something positive. And they are on the plus side of the field with three minutes to go in the half. When Manning is hit as he throws, Malcolm Smith with the pick. And it's a pick six for Malcolm Smith, 22 to nothing, Marshall. You, you know, uh, Kurt Warner talked about Peyton throwing interceptions and how it would affect this game. It was the one thing, the one thing that could not happen if Denver was going to win. 
And guess what? A pick six really changed the landscape of this game. Cliff Averill was getting to Manning that got him uh, to throw it.